Alright, what's up guys? Uh, I figured I owe you guys an update. I haven't made a video in about a couple of weeks and um, stuff has happened and I need to update you guys on it. Um, and I also want to talk about the clan a little bit. So, um, if I, my voice sounds weird, it's because I'm tired, and, um, but I really didn't make this commentary. So, yeah, that's why. But anyway, first off, my Modern Warfare 2 disc is no longer with us. Um, well, technically it is in my house still, but um, I broke it the other day. I got really pissed off and I just broke it. Um, um, when I first did it, I felt kind of stupid, but when I, um, after a while, I didn't really care anymore, um, and if you're wondering, this gameplay is about a couple months old, and I, I don't know why I kept it, the scores aren't all that great, but it's, uh, still pretty decent gameplay, um, um, but it's a normal Modern Warfare 2 gameplay, and, um, yeah, this was before I broke it, uh, so anyway, and, um, another thing I talk about is the Custom Class series now. I will still do that um, if you guys want me doing Call of Duty 4 or uh, World at War. Um, just tell me the class and I will, I'll try to do it. Um, you can go ahead and make it as hard as you want to this time. I don't even care. So, uh, anyway, um, another thing, um, the history class, the history series, um, I either going to talk about a country itself or a um, time period. Uh, the first part I'm talking about, I'm talking about the Cold War or about the Soviet Union. And I'll if it is the Soviet Union, it's going to be very long, and it's going to be three or four parts. Um, I'm leaning towards the Cold War because it's going to take me about one or two parts because the Cold War is kind of long, but it's pretty interesting, though. Um, and um, I, I'm not going to do, like, boring history. It's going to be something like the Cold War, um, which, you know what the Cold War is? I'll give you a little in a nutshell. Um, it was this uh, war that happened between the United States and the Soviet Union that did not involve armed conflict. It was just tensions between each, each country. Um, there were some countries involved, like England and uh, all the other satellite nations, but England was on America's side, and um, what was the other and, um, all the satellite nations of the Soviet Union. I won't go into whole much in depth about that, but that's in a nutshell. Um, but anyway, another thing, um, the gameplays I'm going to use for those, two are from Modern Warfare 2, uh, if I do have to go two parts. Um, and um, one's actually no Russian. I would, before I broke the game, I thought I would capture no no Russian. For some reason, that's a mission. But um, at, at the time, I think I was gonna go for the Soviet Union part. Um, I go four parts with that, but I decided not to. Um, just in case I do decide to. But uh, part one's gonna be Cold War, just so you guys know. And, um, another thing, the clan. Now, the clan will not be named uh, KGB because I Big Smoke told me that uh, KGB has already been taken by um. A Counter Strike clan, and also, um, I found out the other day that uh, many Call of Duty clans in the PS3 have already been argue arguing about that name. So, uh, I don't want to cause more tension there. Um, so, um, another thing, um, the clan itself will be called uh, Who Dares Wins, and we already have one member confirmed. Xanus said he'd join. Uh, he just said he just would leave the Patriots. He didn't feel like doing it anymore. Um, so he told me at least. But anyway. So one member, maybe two, if Big Smoke gets it for the PS3, um, so, yeah, it's two, maybe two members, um, but if you want to, um, what's the word, if you want to try out for it, uh, leave a comment below and I will, um, I'll see to it, you get a re, um, I cannot talk today, I get a tryout, um, um, but if you do make it, you have to create another PSN account, WDW underscore whatever your name is, so, um, so that's basically basically it about the clan. Um, if you wonder where I got Who Dares Wins from, um, it's another little historical re not only a historical reference, but it's um, another English reference. I'm not English or anything, and I don't have any English blood in me. Um, but I'll, I find the British very interesting sometimes, and all their history is uh, it's pretty interesting. Um, so that's why I'm referencing this. But uh, it's, it comes from the British SAS. It's their motto, and um. The British SAS, which they are a uh, spec ops, very special um, ops unit of the British Army. And um, they were in Call of Duty 4, they were one of the main factions. Uh, so, yeah, it's their motto. Um, basically, it, guys. Um, so, leave a custom class custom class in the comments below. Um, I will start doing normal commentaries after this, though, because school has just been really hectic and I have not had time to do commentaries. And, oh, yeah. Since I'm not doing Modern Warfare 2 gameplay anymore, I will be doing Battlefield Bad Company 2 gameplay because I just got done recording a pretty decent match in Conquest and 
pretty sure I'm going to upload that. So um, I apologize for the bad commentary today. I'm kind of tired, um, but I need to get this commentary, commentary out of the way. So see you guys later.